What is going on today, guys? Welcome back. And today we are working on the BRZ and we're gonna be installing something that everyone needs if they have a BRZ FRS 86. What is that? Virgin 2 hood shocks. So some of you may ask, why are they so convenient? They're just hood shocks. The new version is 10% stronger. And let's say you're at a car show or you're outside, you're working on your car and it starts to get windy and you have your hood on the hood prop. Well, as you may well know, the hood is pretty light and especially once it's up, if a gust of wind hit, gets it, it's going to push it back into your windshield. You don't want that. You could end up denting your hood. You could damage your windshield. There's a bunch of other circumstances to where you could just hit your hood prop the hood could fall also for you guys that are boosted your turbo sits up front and a lot of you understand when you go to grab your hood prop to pull it up it's boiling hot you could actually really burn yourself so this takes that out of the equation so it is very convenient to have these hood props they're very easy to install as you'll see it only takes 10 to 15 minutes it only takes a couple different tools. There's no drilling, there's no extra bolts. It uses factory bolts and factory location. It also comes with a two year, 24 month warranty. So if you guys have any problems with them, send us over an email, we'll get it taken care of. So let's go ahead and get them put on. So the only tools you're going to need, a 12 millimeter, a 10 millimeter, an extension, and a ratchet. All right, so first thing we're going to do, go ahead and crack this top one loose and crack this lower one right here loose. I'll take the upper one off. All right, so first one we're going to do is this little nub is going to face out. And we're going to go ahead and... Just finger tighten it in there just a little bit. We're gonna go ahead and just get this snug. And you're gonna want this to be lined up properly so there's an even gap. Now we're gonna go ahead and take our 10 millimeter and loosen that. Now this one, the nub faces into the engine bay and there's a little plastic here we're going to get it just underneath that enough and then we're not going to get this super tight and then we're going to go ahead and finger tighten this guy in and personally I like this to be pretty much even in the middle and so that's going to be parallel with the fender there and we're just gonna snug it we're not gonna get it crazy tight and the same with this we're gonna just go ahead and make sure it's nice and snug then if you notice this already has the clips in it same with this side so this side goes on the bottom Put the upper one on. I'm gonna go ahead and set this up. Get that right spot and pop it in. And it will technically hold up on just one hood shock so we can do the other side. And if you notice, this gives you another inch or so more. This can also be adjusted so it can go higher if you need. It's all personal preference. So this is how we like to set ours up. All right, and this side is the same. So I'm just gonna do this really quick for you guys so you don't have to sit through that. So 
some of you guys know, you can actually go ahead and remove this. So you can go ahead and remove this and you can just put this away. You don't need this anymore because you have hood shocks. So there's no reason to have the hood prop on your car. Weight savings. All you have to do is lift up and then lean this forward and pull, pull it right out. So it just has this little hook in there. Go ahead and push it in, twist it forward towards the engine bay, and then you can go ahead and clip it back in. Simple as that. All right, and you can just go ahead and close the hood and open the hood. Pretty sweet. You can actually have the hood just slightly propped. So if you're at like a little meetup or a car show or something like that, you can just have your hood just a quarter of the way open even have it about halfway and then all the way and then with closing this since you don't have uh, as much weight now because it's on there you can just go ahead and push it on down she latches right into place All right, super simple, right? If you have any comments, questions, or concerns, go ahead and leave it in the comments down below. Make sure you hit subscribe, give us a like. That's it on this episode. Thank you very much and have a good day. Peace.